welcome to UJC Boxing. This fight is brought to you by Club Ice by Richard Giuliano and Greg Glicker. Flyweight. 142. Batty equal? Let's go. 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 Let's go
now just dancing around the ring. <clears throat> what do you think of uh, Ryan Bunting's strategy so far? I'm um, just waiting for oh, him to the land the big hit. Oh, there it is. Another, another one. one. Eels lands onto the chest. I was about to say Ryan Bunting has got to attack a little bit, but oh. then he hits two combos. Yeah, he does another spin there. Oh, a big right to the face of Eels. And he runs away now. He's trying to recover him. Yeah. And the old Floyd Mayweather, they call it, running away from the fighter. It's a good strategy, though. In the corner. Now Ryan's, he's in the corner. Throws that right hand again, which he's been using a lot today. He's been landing a good amount of shots to the body, Bunting. And now, uh... This is probably Ryan Bunting's best round so far. Yeah, he's been electrifying, to say the least. Oh, a good right. Or left, should I say, and misses the right from Eels. We are up in round four now, and what a fight it's been in the UJHG Boxing League, despite not being a championship. Round four here could be the decider. Yeah, these first three rounds have been pretty even between the two fighters. We'll have to see how the judges score them. And a good one-two combo there. Bunting fakes the jab. Oh. Misses the right hook. Both fighters just faking and looking for an opening. Bunting. He's going uh, at him. Yeah, he's going. He's really going at him there. Looks like he's trying to take this round. He has managed to dodge most of those shots, though. One to the body that ended. And now Eels chasing Bunting into the corner. He lands one. Another one. Bunting shakes his uh, hair in front of the camera. And uh, Bunting now moving over to the other corner. Is he a little uh, frazzled after that attack? What do you think? Um, I think Ryan started out this round pretty well, but then Liam had that big combo right there. Yeah, we'll see what happens now. Can Liam take advantage of the uh, pressure he's mounting on Bunsing? Oh, it's oh, a knockdown! Oh, it's freaking hammock on him! What a shot from Liam! It was a right uppercut onto the chin. Bunsing's back up quickly, though. The first knockdown in UJHD boxing history. He's going at him. Liam is out for blood. About 10 seconds, right? And that is right at the end of round four. That is it. We're into round five now, and a big round for Liam there. What do you think about that knockdown he landed? That could be the decider in this fight, honestly. It was a wonderful uppercut onto the chin, and now Bunting knows he needs something big in this round. He's really coming at Eels. Hits a right onto the chest. A little bit Bunting of a shove him there. Oh. Yeah. Looks like Liam might have just slipped. Yeah, we'll, I don't know. We'll have to look at the replays there. And both fighters getting back to the center of the ring now. <laughs> Eels, look at those uh, boxing shoes he's got. Pretty sweet. And uh, no Rocking punches being yeah, no punches being thrown right now though. Both fighters just waiting for an opening. Uh, it's a Both hit to the body. Up. Yeah. Good blocks from Ryan there. Yeah. Right. Eels went for the body shot. Both fighters throwing some jabs. Uh, right hook from Bunting misses. Pretty uneventful round so far. Yeah, both fighters seem content with what they've done so far, but will it be enough? Eel's going for more blood now. Still no punches being landed in this round, I don't believe. Dancing around the ring. And uh, that will do it for this fight. <laughs> Judges have a unanimous decision. And the winner, Liam Eels! We're not, we're not here. <laughs> <laughs> Close fight. We both had our hits. Uh, that one knockdown killed me. Kind of slipped up there. That was a problem. Uh, any any idea on, on who you want to challenge next? Uh, I think, you know, if we're looking at like weight, you know, boxing ability. I think, I think I would match up well against Ethan McConaughey. I think that'd be a good fight. Champion. Championship uh, match, champion maybe, on the horizon. I'd, uh, after that loss, I'd like to, bounce, like to bounce back, maybe take home the title. Yeah, good. Uh, Liam, uh, what's your next step in your boxing career? Uh, I've been thinking for a while. I'm calling out Mateo uh, for my next fight in my career. He weighs a lot, so he's perfect. And I'm going to beat him up. <laughs> All right. Um, 
How do you feel after this big win? I feel good. He was a good fighter. Pretty fair. But in the end, I came out winning. And uh, it was fun. Yeah, thanks, Ed.